Carnival date. So, this is how you treat a girl? Well, not me. What are you talking about? We had a date and you are three minutes late. No, we didn't. Yes, we did. No, we really didn't. But look, I remembered how much you like flowers. Oh, damn. That wasn't you. That was Darby. Well, he's late. I cannot believe he's done this to me. Oh, and those are so beautiful. Three minutes. What does he think I am? A tramp? Ugh. I hope something important happened. Like he's dead. Because otherwise, there's no excuse. Did you say you're waiting for Darby? Yes. I don't really like him, but he's my cousin and our family wants us to get married. You know, keep up the tradition. Wait, marry your cousin? You know, it used to be brother and sister until it was made illegal. My aunt has four thumbs. Really? Yeah, well, I'm not marrying him now. He's humiliated me. So, uh, what do you say you and I go out and leave Darby to another cousin? Great. You know, I'll meet you at the carnival tonight. Jimmy, I'm really starting to like you. Hmm. Interesting. Carnival closes at one. Make sure you get there. Yeah, man. You're rushing. Shouldn't be able to come in. It's almost one o'clock, it's almost two o'clock, and Jimmy's going to pass up. What I got to get the bear? Yeah, right. 
It ain't funny, buddy. Teddy bear still? I thought I gave it to her. Right, your boy Jimmy gotta get some sleep. Wanna play? Not with you, weirdo. What have we here? I get the playing card? I don't think so, right? Because the bike wanted to fall. Jimmy's about to drop. Not too bad. No. Be right here. We'll send a race to the veil. Mission. I'm not going to no more classes for a little bit. Sick of them. She was actually an okay class. Uh, I'm gonna go to chemistry. Change my mind. I like chemistry. Don't feel like walking all the way over there, so. You know who I am. Bullworth one. Yeah, Jimmy take me to chemistry. Easy little shortcut. Like I'm going to respect that old fool. Please go to your lab stations. Don't get too creative now, and for God's sake, don't eat anything. <laughs> Fascinating, isn't it? Why? Keep up the good work. You're almost done. Good job. Keep paying attention. You may have a Look at that ahead of you, young man. I can do that. I can do that. It's easy when you know how. And that's that. people out on the way there.
Hey, Pete. Where is everybody? Oh, Jimmy. It's you. Yeah? I guess you want to kill Gary now that he's turned most of the school against you and got those rich kids to throw eggs at you. Gary will get what's coming to him. What's wrong with you? Nothing. Well, you're sitting around watching TV by yourself like a loser. Someone crap in your bed? What's wrong? Well, for one moment, I had friends. Just one moment. You and Gary. Yeah, Gary's a snake, and you're a psychopath. Ah, oh, come you on. You both bullied me mercilessly, but at least I wasn't left out. And now I'm back on my own, and I'm too cool to be a dork, and I'm too dorky to be anything else. You're not on your own. Where is everybody? At the bike race at Old Bullworth Vale. By shiny bikes at the beach. Bike race? Why didn't you say so? Come on. takes off on that bike, he is gone. Look at that, he's here already. You pathetic wretches! Come on! <laughs> Don't make me laugh! They've got nothing on us! We got the cheerleaders here too? that I had. It was English. Still got time to make it to English. I'm not doing English. You really should. I ain't doing English. Yeah, you want to get a C-785. 
then dismantle it and recouple with a 767 in titanium. Very expensive, but it will make your machine fly. That's what the pros do. Really? I was gonna get the 976 because I thought it would make me look important amongst my peer group. A 976? What are you, a girl? Oh, here's the kid who won the race. Hey. You came for your trophy, huh? Yep. Here she is. Beautiful. Molded plastic, covered in aluminum wrap, with your name misspelled on it. Excellent. Great. Look at this. A bunch of guys whose career aspirations are to work in stores. Fabulous. I love it when people know their place in life. <laughs> <laughs> well, your place in life is in my toilet. You trust fun turd? Do you even have flushing toilets in your trailer? I couldn't imagine it. You guys are a bunch of scumbags, aren't you? What you got? Bring it. Come on. Nice trophy. Hey, let me see. Come on. Hey, <laughs> give me that back. to the place that you gave to me? Give me a hand, chaps. I'm gonna feel bad about this tomorrow. I'm good. That's all there is to it. Sweet clothes, poser. What's going on? Yeah, you're a real winner. <laughs> Thanks, man. Russell, <laughs> calm down, calm down. <laughs> Sit. <laughs> good boy. Thank you, thank you. Jeez, that dumb kid's really strong. Dumb? Hey, be good. No. Be good. Not you, Einstein, not you. So, how did everything work out with those eggs? Not like I was hoping. Never trust a rich kid. Too bad, too bad. Was it that jerk, Tad? You know, his parents are at a party at my boss's house right now. If he wanted a revenge thing, now would be a good time. I guess I'll need some more eggs then. Ah, yes. You got it. Thanks. Come on, Russell. We've got a house call to make. He's taking off. But I'm fast on the bike, man.
Easy peasy. That's not the same way I entered, so I'm gonna bite. Jimmy comes through again. So how do I do it, Pete? Do what? Beat those rich kids into submission. Well, what have you tried so far? Random violence, widespread destruction, gratuitous sadism. No, no, that's not gonna work. They get all that kind of stuff at home. Now what you gotta do is you gotta beat one of them publicly. You gotta prove to them you're better than their best man. Why don't you box that dumb jerk Biff? Not bad, Pete. Not bad at all. All right, see you around. Wait, Jimmy, can I come too? You know what? Don't worry about it. Is it snowing? Gotta get this man a coat. You and me what? You and me, the noble art of boxing, may the best man win. And then you little trust fund fairies will know what life is all about. Anytime, Popper. Of course, the best man always wins. Me. Come on. Afterwards, you can clean my shoes. Oh, 
Alright, he did pretty good that first round. a champion it takes breeding and nepotism and snobbery you filthy democrat gentlemen are we going to let some gutter snipe come in and beat up our friend biff no. No. then what are we going to do beat him back to the ghetto yeah, yeah. yeah. Beats him back to the ghetto. You guys soften him up. I'll get a drink. I'll put you in. I'm a fighting machine. I'm not fighting out. I'm an excellent boxer, you know. Get out. You are messy. Come to get wrong. You want to stay in there and fight them for it. Hiding behind your friends. I'm leveraging the assets I have, and you don't. Friends. Just shut up, Darby. Here's some more tactics for you. I think I'll boy. This. Why are girls so hard to understand? I mean, I have money. Get out of here! Oh. trying to jump somebody. Who's the boss now? I can't hear you, rich kids. Who's the boss now, my waspy little friend? Answer the question. You are... Louder! You are... Uh, That's right. Me. Now you girls, learn to play nice. You understand? 